بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس آئی ایم یور آئی ٹی ٹیچر شاہد علی خان اینڈ ٹوڈے وی ول ڈسکس اباؤٹ کمپیوٹر سائنس پیپر پیٹرن فار کلاس ایس ایس سی ٹو دیٹ از کلاس ٹین اینڈ دا سیل سلیبس آف دس پیپر پیٹرن از اکارڈنگ ٹو ایف بی آئی ایس سی اسلام آباد So let's see what we have inside the paper pattern of computer science. It has total marks 55 in this computer science paper for class 10, SSC2. Total marks are 55. And section A, we can see section A has 12 marks. And section A covered MCQs. And MCQs are included from all the chapters and topics. MCQs means multiple choice questions included from all chapters and topics. They are not only from the exercise given in the each chapters, but as well as they could come from any topic. So MCQs could become from any topic. So it has 12 marks of section A. So let's move towards the next section. That is section B. Section B has 27 marks and it covered all chapters. Normally in section B, we have short questions. So short questions could be come from any chapters. Any chapters that is included into your syllabus according to the FBISC paper pattern. So short questions included in section B. And how could you will get 27 marks from section B? So there are, uh, you have to attempt nine questions or nine parts from 13 questions given and all parts carry equal marks. In section B, you have to attempt nine questions from the 13 given questions and each question have three marks. So that means you will have 27 marks. Nine multiply by three, 27. So you will get 27 marks in section B. So let's move students towards the next section of computer science paper pattern for class SSC2. Section C. Section C has 16 marks and which chapters it covers? All chapters. In section C, it is also covered all chapters and section C has long questions that cover all chapters of your syllabus. So how could we get 16 marks from section C? You have to attempt any two questions or two parts from the three given questions that means you have one question choice all parts carry equal marks or all questions carry equal marks it means you have to attempt two that means all all question have eight marks that means eight to the 16 or two into eight is equal to 16 so you will get 16 marks in section c so let's get the total of marks from different sections. Section B plus C has 27 plus 16. So total marks will be A plus B plus C. 12 marks of section A. 27 marks of section B. And 16 marks of section C. So it will become 55 marks. So we have 55 marks paper of computer science. So this paper pattern is helpful for you. And it will be applicable in 2021 computer science paper ssc2 i hope students that you have understood this paper pattern if you have any question you can ask in the upcoming next video we will discuss about different topic of computer science so until that allah hafiz i am going to signing out